Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we're out here in Rancho Del Arroyo and we are going to be hunting some muleys today. And the mule deer hunting in Rancho is pretty awesome. You want to go to Alright. No? Yeah, we got him. I wasn't gonna and then I thought, ah, oh, what the heck. <laughs> So in yesterday's video, we found a massive level five muley. We are gonna go out and find him today. He definitely needs to die. He is a monster. I'm very excited to go out and find him. And we are gonna be hunting muleys all over this map. See what we can find. If you do enjoy the video, guys, make sure to hit that like button. If you'd like to join us for more daily Call of the Wild content, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to click the notify bell and we're gonna head right into it. Now let me know in the comments, guys, what your very favorite thing to hunt in Rancho is and why. I would love to know. Now I guess we now have muleys on what, three maps? We have them in Parque Fernando, we have them in Silver Ridge Peaks, and we have them here in Rancho. So that's pretty sweet. I don't know what the best map is for muleys. That is yet to be determined. And he's just a little guy, 137. And this guy's not much bigger. 160, but that was a double lung heart shot from 216 meters, and I am using the 303. All right, let's go find some bigger ones. Okay, guys, we got eyes. Oh, we did a second ago. Where'd he go? There he is. There is our massive level five buck. Look at the size of him. Now, where the heck is he going? I wonder if I can What a stunner. Oh my goodness, look at that trophy rating. 305 to 366. I don't know what to do. I'd love to take him with the bow, but... Hmm. All right, so I think what I'm gonna do is I am gonna call here with my bleak collar. It seems to be keeping him there, keeping his attention, and I am going to stay prone and crawl my way over there and see how close we can get to him. Maybe I will use the bow. I'm not sure. I would love to. We'll see if we can get him to stay there. My goodness, he is so amazingly gorgeous. This might be the nicest muley that I've ever seen. And I think this will make my fourth diamond muley on PC since I did start in November. Look at him. I think we're just gonna shoot him. I think he is getting ready to bolt. He is. Yes, I think we did get him. And he dead. Yay, that's amazing. I am so excited. Let's go get him. Yeah, this muley has probably the coolest rack that I've ever seen on a mule deer. This is probably my favorite diamond muley that I've ever shot. And I do have quite a few on Xbox as well. But look at the size of this rack. I just love the shape of it. He is, he looks like a tree. I can't believe all of the points coming out of this rack. This is pretty crazy. Wow. All right, let's pick him up and have a look at him. Oh my goodness. So he is an absolute monster. He is a 323.9. He weighs 202.42 kilograms. And that was a double lung shot from 61.68 meters. And that is pretty sweet. He is absolutely stunning. And this is where we found him. Y Lake, bottom right corner, these three lakes and the lake to the left with the island are amazing for muleys. Definitely drop a tent there. I would highly recommend it. Such a great spot. Oh my goodness. <laughs> There's another level five. What is happening? That guy's a monster as well. He's not diamond potential, but he's big as well. But look at that. That is crazy. We just took down a level five diamond just a few hours ago and he is still on our codex and we have another one right here. That is nuts. And we aren't even very far from where we shot that other one. This corner is crazy. Now this rack I thought was supposed to be taken out of the game. I actually do have a diamond really. In this shape, it's not the best shape, but it is more than likely a diamond. I think he probably is, but let's find out. I think what's happening is this rack is inverted. I heard that I heard that that's a little bug that's happening right now, and I think that might be what's happening to this guy. 
so the other level five was right here. These three lakes, I guess four lakes, in the bottom right-hand corner. Let me show you where we are, guys. The muley hunting in this little area. Awesome. Very awesome. Okay, so we are going to sneak in here and see if we can't take this level five down with the bow. Now, it might be challenging. It's not exactly clear terrain here. It is tough to see with all of the cactuses. And there are quite a, quite a few muleys here. But I am going to use the bleak collar and see if we can't get him out. Now, I'm sure all the little ones will start running towards the call. And then they will spook. But can we find the level 5? I have not seen him yet. And that is concerning me. I snuck in here as slowly as I could, but I lost view. And he may have spooked. And I literally don't see him here. I don't think he's here. I think he... I think he bolted. I mean, level 5s have the highest artificial intelligence. But there is a really nice one there. There's that 4. Maybe we can take him. I wouldn't mind. Let's try. Since we're here anyway. Now I have the CB70 with me today. With the single pin sight. The bright side sight. And... I understand the... Bright side rangefinder bow sight is not working properly, guys, so don't use it until it's fixed. That's why I'm not using it right now. Let's get this guy. Oh, and he's down! We did get him! And off they go. Well, it looks like we're gonna have to come in again for that level 5, but at least we did get to take one down. Let's have a look at him. And here he is, and he is pretty nice. We did not get a vital shot on him, unfortunately. We did hit thoracic, but we did take him down. He is a 247.2, 176.06 kilograms, and that shot was from 23.42 meters. He is still a really nice muley, but we are going to have to come back for that level 5, unfortunately. That is what happens when you try and sneak in with the bow. Okay, so I did change the time, and we are back here. And there's actually another humongous herd of muleys just around the corner from this zone, so I can't believe all the muleys in this area. Pretty crazy. All right, so they are here, but I have not spotted the level five yet. There are quite a lot of them. So I'm wondering if he's in here somewhere. He's gotta be there somewhere. I don't even think I have the 22 on me. Okay, they're actually listening to my call. Yay! Sweet. Some of them. There he is. I think that's too tough. But I don't love this angle and I'm not going to take it because the frontal shots are just not... not what we should be doing right now. Alright, we're going to shoot him because I just think it will be very difficult to get in there with the bow. With all these deer in the way, and all these cactuses, and all these hills. And I think he'll spook again. That guy's a monster as well. It's pretty crazy. Alright. We're gonna have our chance right now. I don't like that. Stop. And he's, he's down, he dead. And he is gonna be a floater. So we will just sit tight. Seeing as we already tried to sneak in there with the bow, I just think with the way all the deer are blocking it, it would be pretty crazy. And we would probably have to do it a few times. It's thick here. Hey, maybe we can get another one. They're freaking out. Oh yeah, that one. You gotta love it when your diamonds, hopeful diamonds, are being delivered to you. Seriously, keep floating. Oh, he is very big. He's a big one. All right, here we go. 
He is a diamond. He is a humongous max weight 338.8 diamond, 210 kilograms. And that was a double lung heart shot. Look at that. Nice. Yeah, better taxi him. Well, that is amazing. And that is where we found them. Right here, Island Lake. So Muley's drink from 14 or 14.30 until 17 or 17.30 here in Rancho. There were so many muleys in this herd. This would be an amazing spot to drop a tent and a tripod, if, especially if you are gonna farm muleys. All right, look at this beast. That is another really, really nice muley, 256. And that was a right lung shot from 180.12 meters with a 303. Not too bad. Not too bad. He's really nice. Very nice. I am really enjoying the muley hunting here in Rancho. <laughs> Not gonna lie. It's been a lot of fun. Oh, there's another beast. I must shoot him. As you can see, the muley hunting here in Rancho is pretty amazing. We're gonna take this guy. He dead. And down he goes. Oh, and look at this one. Another beautiful, crazy, amazing buck. 273.2. <laughs> that is amazing. Alrighty, guys. So this is my muley room, and I have a pretty awesome collection of muleys. I've been doing not too bad in that department. The only thing we really, really need is a really nice melanistic muley, and that is not going to be an easy thing to find. But these are our two diamonds from today. Look at this guy. I love his rack. I absolutely love his rack. Let's see if we can pick him up here. There we go. So he's a 323.9. And he is stunning. He is one of my favorite diamond muleys ever. I'll show you a couple other ones in just a sec. This guy is max weight, 338. He doesn't have the nicest of racks. I have his twin over here. This guy I think I got on Christmas day, just after midnight last year. And that's another really cool one that I have. I like his rack quite a lot as well. So those are our two piebalds. That's our albino, and we have a pretty nice dilute. We need a melanistic now, so we do have something more to go for. But that is going to wrap it up for this one, guys. What a crazy muley hunt. That was so much fun. If you did enjoy the video, guys, I'm going to ask you to smash that like button. And if you'd like to join us for more daily Call of the Wild content, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to click the notify bell, and we will see you guys in the next one. Take care, guys.